New RVV MD-2 air-to-air short-range missiles for the Russian Su-57 stealth fighters, which have no analogs in the world, have been developed. To reduce radar visibility, fifth-generation weapons are placed in the inner fuselage compartments of the aircraft. This is reported by RIA Novosti with reference to a representative of the company Goss MKB Vimpel. In Russia, the development of fifth-generation air-to-air missiles, which have reached the industrial stage of production, is five to ten years ahead of similar developments in the United States, the publication says. At the same time, ammunition is already undergoing the procedure for adoption. It should be noted that for the first time RVVMD melee missiles were demonstrated at the MOX 2009 airshow. The new short-range missile is designed to attack air targets in highly maneuverable close combat at any time of the day and in any direction relative to the carrier aircraft. The rocket has a cylindrical body with a total length of 2.92 meters and a diameter of 0.17 meters. The launch weight of the rocket is 106 kilograms, and the warhead is 8 kilograms of explosives and is stuffed with rods to hit targets. The RVVMD guided missile is capable of hitting targets flying at speeds up to 2,500 meters per second at altitudes from 20 meters to 20 kilometers. At the same time, aircraft that perform a maneuver with an overload of up to 12 units are also guaranteed to be destroyed. The new RVVMD-2 missile is a successor to the short-range air-to-air missile RVVMD. According to Rosober One Export, the sole state intermediary agency for Russia's defense exports and imports, the RVVMD air-to-air -air guided missile is specifically engineered to eliminate various air targets such as fighters, attack aircraft, bombers, helicopters, and military transport aircraft. The RVVMD can operate effectively from any direction, day or night, amid challenging electronic countermeasures ECM, environments. With the RVVMD2 carrying forward these advanced features and enhancements, it promises to elevate the combat capabilities of the Su-57 fighter jet even further. The new missile possesses several advantages that Russian media claims will render highly effective and lethal in air warfare. Viktor Murakovsky, the editor-in-chief of the magazine Arsenal of the Fatherland and a military expert, explained to RIA Novosti that the RVVMD-2 is the first short-range missile to incorporate an inertial control system. This system is designed to control and stabilize the missile during autonomous flight. The inertial system operates on the principle of the ammunition autonomously determining its coordinates in space without relying on external landmarks or signals. It calculates its position based on its previous known position, allowing it to navigate and maneuver accurately during its flight trajectory. Furthermore, according to Murakovsky, the RVVMD-2 has a radio correction line that enables the aircraft to refine the target's coordinates.
This enhancement significantly increases the probability of successfully engaging and hitting enemy aircraft during combat. The editor-in-chief of the magazine also highlighted another advantage of the new missile over its previous version, a multi-element dual-band infrared homing head with improved noise immunity. This advanced homing head enables the RVVMD2 to effectively engage targets from all angles, including the rear hemisphere. In other words, the missile can be launched forward, maneuver in mid-air, and successfully hit enemy aircraft trailing behind the Su-57, further boosting its combat capabilities. However, exact details about the plans for the missile's integration into the Su-57 fleet and its overall production scale have yet to be made public. As the development and testing of the missile continue, more information may be released regarding its deployment and production plans.